rather quieter start to the programme this morning. Good morning, Britain. The Prime Minister arrives in Washington, his first foreign trip in the job. Uh, so we've got this root and branch strategic defence review, Prime Minister um, has announced. Um, it includes troop numbers. This yeah. is an ex previous government. Yeah that you would think would be standing up. Uh, uh, yeah. But they will, that is they will still be looking case. at it. But the size of... Modi, previous mm. government, announced it would cut troop numbers from 82,000 to 73,000. Yeah. Mm. I mean, everything's changed, of course, because of this yeah. full sky Putin and the rising global threats. And now, you know, former colonel and British military intelligence Philip Ingram says the government's playing with fire is now and it will take years to fix the army, ammunition stocks and get the RAF and Navy ready. Nigel in, so he could go... Exciting. Nick Dixon, if we get through to the final, will be up against Spain and this... I wasn't scoring fair. We've had seven years' reign in a... Mu I'm slightly exaggerating. Yeah. Why? No. Has no-one told the weather gods? I know. I think... Perhaps a little cloud, mm -hmm. a smattering of drizzle. It's October. I know. It is relentless. It's good for the... Candidate, were the re they a real person? There was a candidate who'd sort of... Um, the World Cup in 1966. ...have correctly picked all... There were even nuts in the oh, other... Oh, <laughs> Should not be in news bulletins. <laughs> Shall I I th absolutely. Let's go with the... Good morning, Britain. Two minutes past six. How excited are you for the game tonight, Ed? I am hugely excited. Cricketing no, no, hero no, for no, England. No, 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 not meant tonight. Oh, the other big game. Yes. Oh, of course. The England. Expect I know. I am really excited. Euro semi-final against I the know. Netherlands. I so know. it's weapon. Yamal, he, um, let in us know. In my mind, in my dreams. Let us know, are you excited oh. about uh, England and the semi-final game tonight? Nick Dixon is, is excited. We're going to talk to him in a couple of minutes, but do let us know. Um, the front of the sun this morning will give your boys one bell. The mirror this morning, bond team spirit ahead of tonight's semi -final. Don't you think, look, even if you're not a football fan? Yeah. Even if you don't normally like football, yeah. even if you like our deputy editor of Rouge, this is one day Isn't where it? you do think, come, come on, on England. England, come on. Right, just coming up to you five minutes past six. That's the end of the football chat for now because our main news is Sakir Starmer arrives in Washington in his first foreign trip since becoming Prime Minister, where he's attending NATO's 75th anniversary summit. And Starmer will use the trip to again commit to increasing the UK's defence spending to 2.5% of GDP, but only after a new strategic review of the armed forces, um, which um, he has announced. Our political correspondent, Louisa J.